As the Royals have struggled this season, so has Nicky Lopez, the former Creighton star in his fourth season in the big leagues, all with Kansas City. And despite the drop in numbers, Lopez says there's still a light at the end of the tunnel for both himself and the boys in blue. Matt Foster has a story from Kauffman Stadium. Even baseball's best hit slumps. Nicky Lopez comes through with two down. Nicky Lopez is no exception to that. I mean, that's baseball. I mean, it's every, every year is different. Um, it's just, you know, the adjustment period and you got to make the necessary adjustments, but that's why we play 162 games. In about 70 of those games, Lopez's lumber has been lacking. He's batting just north of 200 with an OPS that's less than 600. Last year was very good. This year, just a little slow start, but um, a couple couple hits away from, from having a, a better year. So um, I'm not too worried about it, but I know it's it, the balls will fall soon. Lopez racing for third. Lopez had arguably the best season of his major league career in 2021. He hit 300 and almost won a gold glove. Now, while the batting numbers have dropped off a bit, the defense has it as Lopez continues to make plays on the diamond. Lined and caught by Nicky Lopez. I hang my hat on my, my defense. Um, you know, that's something that I always take a lot of pride in and um, something I'll continue to do so. Lopez has learned that the majors are a marathon, not a sprint. And to be successful, you got to bring your best every day at the diamond. Obviously, you can't take, take a day off here. Um, but then again, you know, that's why we play 162. It's a long season. You're going to go through the ups and downs, the, you know, the grinds, um, you know, the, you're going to go on hitting streaks and then you're going to go in slumps. Um, you know, sometimes you're not going to feel good, um, but you got to play through it. He hits it well into left center field. And Lopez feels like that perseverance will pay off one way or another. You know, there's always a light at the end of the tunnel, so you just got to keep pushing forward. In Kansas City, Matt Foster, KETV News Watch 7 Sports.